sure we're close? According to this, we're very close. Who knew it would have taken this long? Any word from Jesse? Not yet. Damn. Well, that's Jesse for you. She's all right. She'll be fine. She can handle herself. How much further, anyway? Freeze! Damn it. Knees on the ground. Hands up. We found them. Robert Mox. This must be the lovely Miss Harris. What do you plan to do? Well, for now, imprison you. Guard, take him to the holding room and have him experience his final moments of life before he meets his end. I... Oh, Madeline! You bring her to me. Don't move. Like I really have that option right now. Come on. Don't I get my one phone call? It won't matter. Nobody's coming for your ass anyway. I wouldn't be too sure of that. Who knows you're here? No one. Don't lie. Who? Bob, I'm taking over the night shift. Bob? Yeah, who the hell are you? Ooh! Nice work, Jesse. I'm the best at what I do. Yeah, but you could have come a little sooner. Thank you would suffice. Thanks. What do you got from it? Well, for starters, there's word of a mole in the embassy feeding information to Mox. Really? Any leads? Who the hell would betray the embassy? I don't know, but that's the least of our worries. What if Mr. Mox has intel on everything that the embassy can do? God. Rob took her. Where? I don't know. She could be alive, or she could be dead. I don't know. But if she is, we gotta get her, and then stop him. What's the plan? Go around. See if any more agents are being held hostage. I'm going after Rob. Alone? I have to. Why do you have to be a hero? It's not like that. I have to settle this once and for all. Wish I could explain it, but I can't. Well, good luck, Nick. You too. So happy you could join us, Mr. Patrona. Please, don't be shy. Twice in one day. How fortunate. Where's that? Oh, believe me, Nick, she's... Well, it's almost like she never existed. You son of a bitch! Well, tell me that's all you got. will be restored. Nothing will change. Uh, my family will remain a bunch of scum to How dare you disgrace my family. Uh, you owe a debt to us after what you've done. Soon, the Mox family reputation will be restored and your precious little embassy 
Vou forro. Over my dead body. Who's the mole? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Tell me now. I'll die before I talk. If you wish. My brother and I felt it was right to avenge our father and keep his legacy alive. Our dear father would have succeeded alone if you hadn't murdered him. Richard Mox was a threat to human safety. I had no choice. Not a choice? Just like I don't have a choice if she lives or not. Sorry, Nick, shut up. chance of doing something extraordinary and you let your morals get in the way. Now who's the fool? I'm the fool. My patience has finally paid off. We can finally fulfill our plan. We've infiltrated every part of the embassy. Soon we will obtain every byte of information in our databases. And we will sell them to the highest bidder. The embassy will crumble. Oh, but don't worry, Nick. You'll be dead before you can witness such glory. Tara, the time is now. Take the girl with us. She may prove to be useful at all. Not yet. Let him reflect on his pitiful existence and pray for reconciliation. Then you'll know what to do. Oh, but don't worry, Nick. I'll make sure everyone knows how you failed all of us. Farewell, brother. the embassy. Is going on here? Do it. 
Excellent. We have eight minutes. Tired to the chair. Can't have her running away. Go guard outside. Fair. I deserve vengeance. It may be a time for vengeance. But it wasn't yours. the day. We're alive, and we saved the embassy. Always the hero. I guess some things never change. <laughs>